If there is anything we know about crazy wealthy Nigerian family, the Otedolas, it is that they love to do everything in an extravagant and luxurious style. Women going all out and celebrating like it's a national holiday. As you may have imagined, they didn't disappoint on November 4, 2022, when the family patriarch and billionaire businessman Femi Otedola celebrated his 60th birthday. Sparing absolutely no expenses for his Diamond Jubilee occasion, the billionaire oil mogul, who has an estimated net worth of $1.6 billion, chose to fulfill his childhood dream by celebrating his 60th birthday aboard the luxurious super yacht Christiana O, owned by his role model and late Greek billionaire Aristotle Onassis. Breaking the internet with exquisite videos and photos from the simple yet lavish birthday bash, Bilonia Harris, DJ Copy, revealed her father was always fantasized about visiting the iconic super yacht from the age of 11 because his role model owned it. Now that the chairman of Gerigu Power is clocking 60, he felt there is no better way to splash some of his billions than renting the same yacht his late mentor cruised in his lifetime. According to reports, Otedola, who has been vacationing in Venice, Italy for months, doled out a whooping 2.2 billion naira to sail the Mediterranean Sea on this super yacht for three weeks. As you imagine, the former chairman of Fort Oil is not celebrating alone but with his closest family, including his beautiful wife, Nana Otedola, his daughters, Tolani, Temi, and Florence, aka DJ Copy, his only son, Fewa. But there is one more person in the role. Mr. Easy is soon to be son-in-law. Who wants to party like an Ubikubana when they can party like 1% of the 1% in the world? Sit back as we give you the tea of how Bologna businessman Femi Otedola paid 2.2 billion naira to celebrate his 60th birthday aboard the luxurious super yacht Christiana O and made it clear to his fellow Nigerian Bologna's who the boss of throwing parties really is. Hey, hey, come papa, go papa, go papa, hey, hey, hey. Hello guys, it's Tico here for African Glitz. When it comes to making big money making moves, cool, calm, collected and stylish billionaire businessman Femi Otedola consistently ranks top 5 in the country. And when it comes to spending money, we mean millions and billions, you can always be sure to spot the oil mogul in the top 5 list. Who knows? This may be why he is famous for throwing some of the country's best and most extravagant parties. You know, money talks. The finest champagne, caviar, gourmet treats, destination parties, and walks. For those who don't know the billionaire businessman, Femi Otedola is a native of Ekpe, Lagos State, but was born in Ibadan, Oyo State, where he had his elementary education. Also known as Ote, he is the son of former governor of Lagos State, Sam Michael Otedola, and serial businesswoman, Lady Dodger. Starting his career, Otedola worked at his family printing company before resigning to start his own business. Years later, the oil and gas industry would see the quintessential billionaire redefine the oil and gas retail market in the country and abroad after he established Xenon Oil. By 2007, Femi Otedola added a new position to his portfolio, becoming the chairman of African Petroleum, which later rebranded to Fort Oil. Beyond dominating the oil and gas industry with his brilliant investment ideas, Otedola owns other shipping, real estate and finance businesses. In his leisure time, the businessman loves to give back to society. As a result, he has been dubbed a silent philanthropist, earning him the nickname Baba Lanu. Today, the father of four is proudly the single largest shareholder of First Bank PLC and the executive chairman of Giregu Power. According to Forbes, the energy mogul is among the top billionaires in the country with an estimated net worth of $1.6 billion. But you all know that saying, there is time to make money and then there is time to spend the money. The billionaire businessman never misses an opportunity to spend his money flamboyantly, especially at lavish parties. In the past, the oil mogul raised temperatures and sent everyone into a frenzy with expensive purchases and parties. This year alone, Otedola shut down Ekpe on April 3, 2022 to celebrate his mother's 90th birthday anniversary. Leaving no room for Nigerians to recover from the lavish display of wealth, the billionaire has got tongues wagging again after he doled out a whooping 3 million euros to celebrate his birthday in style and luxury as he turned 60 on November 4, 2022. 
Going all out and spending no dollars or euros, the Chancellor of St. Augustine University ditched the usual fancy parties for a captivating experience on the legendary super yacht Christiana O, owned by his childhood idol Aristotle Onassis. According to reports, the highly successful entrepreneur will sail aboard the luxury yacht for three weeks with only his closest family members. Spilling the tea of what inspired a father's intimate but luxurious 60th birthday celebration aboard the iconic moto yacht, Bilonia Harris and singer DJ Copy, who will be celebrating her 30th birthday later this month, revealed it has always been a father's dream to visit the super yacht from when he was 11 years old because it was owned by his mentor and role model. Sharing a video of the family dancing and vibing to the popular Barbie Girl song, she wrote, To celebrate his 60th, not only did he visit the yacht but has chattered it for his loved ones so we can live here for the next three weeks. Looking at my father, I can see how happy, accomplished and still in disbelief he is. This is what love looks like. Hashtag family first. Chase your dreams, you never know. Christiana O is one of the most iconic private motor yachts ever launched. Known for her grand interiors and unrivaled extravagant features, she is the 59th largest yacht in the world. Late Greek shipping billionaire Aristotle Onassis, who at some point was regarded as the wealthiest man in the world, purchased it in 1954 while starting life as a Canadian frigate. Onassis got it for $34,000 US dollars and then spent another $4 million US dollars to convert it into a luxurious super yacht before naming the beauty after his daughter, Christiana O. For a motorboat offering an unforgettable experience, privacy, and world-class entertainment that is not limited to fine dining and whining, spa treatment, luxury soiree, swimming, jet skiing, kayaking, paddle boards, and even karaoke, the iconic yacht has had notable passengers aboard her. Among them are Winston Churchill, the Reina 3, the Prince of Monaco and Grace Kelly, who had their wedding reception aboard the yacht in 1956, John Wayne, Elizabeth Taylor, John F. Kennedy, Frank Sinatra and Richard Burton. Now, Femi Otedola has joined the exclusive list of personalities who have cruised the iconic super yacht and it's a dream come true. Storming France with so much excitement in the air, the Otedolas, alongside their soon-to-be son-in-law, Mr. Easy, flew into the French Republic in a private jet before boarding a luxury van to Antibes, where they welcomed aboard the Christiana O for the experience of their lifetime. In a viral video, the wealthy Nigerian family were captured boarding the yacht as the yacht crew gave them all a VVIP reception. The crew could be heard greeting the oil mogul, Mr. Femi, welcome back, giving many the impression that the Otedola Petrak may have been aboard the yacht in the past but maybe as a guest and not the host. Regardless, the family have had the fun of their lifetime. When Copy, a mother of two adopted dogs, Fufun and Dudu, is not giving us a tour of the luxurious boat or visiting an island nearby like Monaco. In a viral video, the family were captured rocking party hats alongside the celebrant while they danced heartily to soft music. But of course, the celebration would be incomplete without the Afrobeat tunes. And this is where Mr. Easy comes in. The future son-in-law of the Bilonia family was captured serenading everyone with his hit song, Legalize, a record he dedicated to his fiancée, Temi Otedola. The singer, who had long won the heart of everyone on the family Bilonia, gave a heart-melting performance of the acoustic version of his hit single while copy flexed a DJing talent in the background. Now I found you, I'm searching no more. I don't want to do no fur, baby, make we get a nice. Hey! I don't want to stop anytime you will give me my vibes. Even if you don't know me, I'm going to make you realize. I'm going to let you go, baby, now you be my wife. Baby, give me your love. All your love. Give me your love. Oh. Since the Otedo last boarded the luxurious yacht to celebrate the family pay track, many on social media have been going gaga over the lavish display of wealth and class, and here is what some people have to say about it. Reacting, a Twitter user wrote, Otedola dropped 2.2 billion naira to rent a yacht for 3 weeks to celebrate his 60th birthday. It's one thing to have money, it's another thing to know how to enjoy your money. 
this man knows how to enjoy. Also reacting, another Twitter user wrote, Femi Otedola spending billions of naira to celebrate his birthday, but one motivational speaker from Ikorodu will tell you billionaires don't spend on luxurious life. If you like, have money and don't spend it on yourself. Now one day your next of king will withdraw everything. Advising the billionaire on how to spend the money, another Twitter user wrote, At Femi Otedola, happy birthday to you sir. It would have been more nice if money used in chattering this yacht can be used to feed millions of Nigerians in this hard time. The blessing you will receive from God will outnumber the benefits you derive from this trip. Carpeting all the big boys throwing extravagant parties, another user tweeted, Do you see how Femi the last birthday went? Did you see the number of people present when Mr. Easy was performing? Did you see anyone spraying money on the ground? No. It was a cold party, but you who is struggling to make 100 million naira will be doing graphics for birthday bash. Keep it up. Reacting to Mr. Easy's presence on the celebration, a Twitter user wrote, No be Mr. Easy gets dream, but Nahim de Christiana O. Sometimes don't dream, just stay with Percy we get dream. Here are more highlights from Femi Otedola's 60th birthday celebration. a way to celebrate one's 60th birthday. Like Bilonia Harris DJ Copy said, Chase your dreams, you never know if you will be this lucky too. So tell us guys, what do you think about how Femi Otedola chose to celebrate his 60th birthday? Do you agree the oil mogul went all out to fulfill his childhood dream? Or do you think Femi Otedola should have donated the 2.2 billion naira to the less privileged instead? Share your opinion in the comment section down below. If you found this video informative, please comment, like and share. Also, don't forget to hit the subscribe button to be notified every time I upload a new video so that you don't miss out. Thanks for watching and see you on our next one.